Introduction to Machine Design. This is the broad classification of engineering materials. Gray cast iron is designated based on ultimate tensile strength. There are seven grades from FG150 to FG400. FG150 means gray cast iron with 150 megapascal or 150 newton per mm square of ultimate tensile strength. Steel is designated by specifying tensile strength or by specifying chemical composition. Let us see both of them. By specifying tensile strength, Fe500 means Fe means steel and 500 means minimum ultimate tensile strength. Fe400 means steel with minimum yield strength 400 newton per mm square. Plain carbon steel is designated as double XCX where the first two letters divided by 100 indicates carbon percentage, letter C indicates carbon and last digit divided by 10 indicates percentage of manganese. Let us take an example, 30C8 means 30 divided by 100 0.3% carbon. Letter C indicates carbon and last digit 8 divided by 10 indicates percentage of manganese. Chromium improves hardness, wear resistance, corrosion resistance. Nickel improves toughness, ductility, strength. Manganese improves strength. Silicon is great as a deoxidizing agent. It improves elastic resistance. Uh, limit and resilience. Molybdenum improves hardenability, hardness, toughness, creep resistance. Vanadium improves hardenability, toughness, fatigue strength. Tungsten improves hardness and toughness. Alloy steels BIS designation. First digit by 100 is carbon percentage. Then for next alloying elements, you'll have to refer the table given below. Let us see one BIS designation of alloy steels. 35 divided by 100 indicates carbon percentage. Now we have to see letter uh, table for the other materials. MN is in the second serial number so dividing factor is 4 so 6 divided by 4 1.5% MO is in the last table so 3 divided by 10 0.3% 40 CR 13 MO 10 V2 40 divided by 100 is 0.4% chromium is in the second table so 13 divided by 4 4.25% Molybdenum is 10 divided by 10, 1% and vanadium is 2 divided by 10, 0.2%. 35 Ni 16 CR5, 35 divided by 100 is 0.35%. Ni is 16, so you can see 16 divided by 4 is 4%. 4 CR is 5, second table you can see 5 divided by 4, so 1.25%. High alloy steel is designated by letter X. Number divided by 100 indicates carbon percentage. And after the chemical symbol, whatever is the number, that much is the alloying element percent. X indicates high alloy steel. 30 divided by 100 is 0.3%. Chromium is 13%, no need to divide by any number. Nickel is 6%, no need to divide by any number. The difference between high alloy steel and alloy steel is that in high alloy steel, the addition of all alloying elements would be more than 10%. But in alloy steels, the alloying elements would be less than 10%.
X15 CR25 Ni2 X indicates high alloy steel 15 divided by 100 is 0.15% carbon chromium is 25% nickel is 12% cast steel all the digits after CS indicates ultimate tensile strength CS 640 means CS means cast steels and 640 means ultimate tensile strength of 640 Newton per mm square.